so this is here is a uh, how to we can uh, in accessing the data in matrix how to we can define the row and column indexing so previously we can share uh, like shifting and maybe uh, multiple data how to we access and how to do the plotting and everything we are uh, learning now this is a chapter we can show uh, how to we can define the rows and columns in the form of indexing so here we have the uh, some uh, x of a variable is a usage is the uh, row numbers and column numbers is there then how to we can indexing these rows and columns so they are given the some already they have the data is there, the data they are doing uh, loading here so here here i want to see the try of creating the variable of in the name of v uh, that contains maybe value in the sixth row and third uh, column of the variable uh, uh, variable name is the usage so anyway the usage variable i'm using here so this is usage variable having this much of the data is there this is the data like he, he, in that usage uh, then i have to create one variable that is a v is equal to usage of like a sixth row and third column so i'm taking the first one is uh, like a row and next one is the column i have to define here so in maxim matrix also when i have to define first one is a row second one is a column just you remain and next they are asking to now Trying uh, using of this end complete end in key, uh, keywords to obtain the value of the last row at third column and the variable name again it is usage then I'm taking the usage from variable and assign the value of variable is the name of table. So previously they are asking the variable name is in V now they are asking variable name is a table. So whenever they are asking the now table I'm creating one more variable so it is asking usage again the data usage data. And they're asking last three numbers means I'm using the end comma three. And here they're asking one more that creating the scalar variable is the name of P, and that contains uh, the value of in the second to last row and third column of the usage. So now it is asking to variable is P. Again, I'm using the data of my usage data. Yeah, this usage data. Till I'm using that end minus one comma three. So this is a small quiz. There. Then what is the value of x? And after the countdown is executed, for example, A is a, this is a, I have the data in X of 2 is 3 is equal to. If you know the answer, can you uh, put it in the chat box? So, this is a question like what is the value of IX after the code shown in the executed? That is a, like uh, the value I'm given that A and X of is a 2 of 3. If anybody know the answer, yes, you can type on in chat box. Two, 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 or two plus two. Sure. It's correct. Thank you. Uh, thanks for the, uh, giving in chat box an answer. Like later on, maybe whenever you have the free time, yeah, you can practice on these things so that uh, maybe you are easily you can understand. And if you want to refer something again, here also it is a refer some uh, courses. Always you can come to here, you can refer the courses 